most insect pests in agriculture can be prevented with uh, adequate diversity. The exception to that rule is when you have what we call generalist feeders, plant or insects that eat just about everything. One of those is grasshoppers. So um, no matter how much diversity you get, grasshoppers always seem to be a problem because they eat everything. Doesn't matter what you plant out there, they're probably going to eat on it. Um, so a method of controlling grasshoppers is uh, pretty important and the problem with just going out and indiscriminately spraying for grasshoppers with a broad spectrum insecticide is that you also kill all the beneficial insects. You kill your honeybees, your pollinators, your predatory insects. And so having a means to control generalist feeders like grasshoppers in particular can be pretty important. And what I have here, this is a dead grasshopper that was killed by the disease Nosema locusta. It's a protozoan parasite that naturally occurring and can kill grasshoppers. It uh, turns them this caramel brown color. They usually climb up a stem and die attached to the top of the stem. And so one way of controlling grasshoppers is to purposely spread spores of this disease. And uh, we have the ability to put those spores into a feed stuff that grasshoppers really like to eat, like wheat bran, and then spread that infected bran. And after the grasshoppers eat it, in about three or four weeks, they die of the protozoan parasite. And because grasshoppers tend to be cannibalistic, they will eat their dead comrades. That disease will spread and will actually persist for quite some time once you spread that initial bait. And so I just thought I'd point out the, this caramel colored grasshopper that's dead at the top of one of these stems. That's what killed it. And this is our key to controlling grasshoppers without spraying a broad spectrum insecticide. This parasite only affects grasshoppers and crickets. So it's very, very safe to use. Uh, has very few off target effects, if any. Um, it's a way of just taking out your pest and leaving all your good insects alone.